Hello everyone, in today's video I will be going over the full guide to get Race V4. Race V4 is extremely good for PvP and grinding. Anyway, let's get straight into the first step. To summon the Doe King, you are gonna need a Cake Chalice. To get a Cake Chalice, you will need a God's Chalice and 10 Conjured Cocoa Beans, and the Sweet Crafter will give you the Cake Chalice. To get a God's Chalice, Talk to the elite hunter, and he will give you a quest to kill an NPC. If you kill it, it has a low chance to drop a god's chalice. To get conjured cocoa beans, you will need to kill either of these guys. Then after that, you get the cake chalice, head over to the island where the cookie crafters are, and talk to Drip Mama. She will tell you to kill 500 enemies. After you do that, show Drip Mama the cake chalice, and she will summon the Doe King. Kill the Doe King and he will drop a mirror fractal. The next thing you're gonna need is the blue gear which is found on Mirage Island. I already made two videos on how to find Mirage Island and the blue gear easily, so go check those out. I will just summarize how to find Mirage Island real quick. Buy a boat and sail out to high danger levels behind Tiki Island or Hydra Island. Deal with sea events the best you can and wait for Mirage Island to spawn. The final thing to get Race V4 is to do trails. To access the Race V4 trails, you will need to go to the Temple of Time. Follow me. After you enter the Temple of Time, you will need to pull a lever that reveals all the doors. I will now show you each door for each race. When it says, a full moon has peaked through the clouds, go to your door, someone will most likely to a countdown. Once the countdown finishes, activate your race ability. Each trail is different depending on what race you are. After everyone completes their trails, players will engage in a PvP battle. Last person standing gets their race awakening. She didn't have to cut me off. Like 